John 1, 1 through 5. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was with God in the beginning. Through Him all things were made. With Him nothing was made that has been made. In Him was life, and that life was the light of all mankind. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. Sunday, my pastor of my church, he was talking about something very, very important. And it's really stuck with me each day this week. And as I was studying this, I started thinking, how are we talking to ourselves? How are we speaking about our situations? Are we cursing our situations before we even get going? And what I mean is, you know, like whenever you're tired and you just say, oh, I'm so tired or it's not going your way and you just don't know what else to do. Well, in the beginning, God said, let there be light, let there be man, let there be vegetation, let there be water. So me and my pastor were talking about something. So. God is actually giving us an example of how to take care of our situations. And then we see in John 1, 1, the word was with God. And, and now in context, they're talking about Jesus here. But there's an important principle that I've been chewing on all week. We have to be so careful of how we're speaking about our situations, about how we're speaking about how we feel about how we're speaking about our finances, how we're speaking about our situations in general. So, how are you talking about your situation? How are you talking about the very thing that has come against you? And, and I just wanna pause here and say this, for the enemy to be coming after you, that must mean that you have something attached to you, that you have greatness that is within, so it is the God within you that the enemy is trying to attack. So right now, in the mighty name of Jesus, I speak to that side of you. I speak that the God within you would start coming forth and that the light that has been installed in you from the beginning of time, I pray that it begins to illuminate all the areas that we need to start speaking better. I pray right now in the mighty name of Jesus, and I curse, I curse that spirit of orphan, that orphan spirit that is trying to make you feel like you're not good enough. I curse it and send it back to the abyss right now in the mighty name of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus over your mind, over your mouth, over your heart right now in Jesus' mighty name. Holy Spirit, I ask that you breathe on this individual right now with the breath of life so they can start seeing who they are in you. So if you're facing something, whatever it might be, just begin speaking. Let there be peace. Let there be victory. Let there be freedom in Jesus' name. Listen, I hope this helped you. In, in any way. I hope that this spoke to you. And if it did, go ahead and follow me if you're not already. And go ahead and smash that like button for me. And let's keep this going. I want to try to unravel this onion with you each day. Just know, I love you so much.